Good morning, everybody. I am super excited because um, I've been losing things. And I don't know if it's Alzheimer's. I got too much going on, and it's like I just need to slow down. And so I know what the heck I'm doing and get with life. But anyway, so about six months ago, I lost my charm bracelet. It's very, very special to me. And, um,. I've been searching for it, searching for it. I mean, looking all over the place for it, like a crazy lady. And today, I was in my car. Um, I stopped looking for it months ago. But I was in my car with my daughter at the drive through and um, start looking through my center console that I've looked in a hundred times. I look in it every day for a charger for my phone. And... Um, I found my charm bracelet and I am so excited my initial reaction I was in tears like a crazy lady um, because it's so special to me um, here is my charm bracelet and it's James, a James Avery is the retailer that the bracelet and the majority of my charms came from like my very first charm that I got was my um, RN charm and that was given to me by a very very dear friend of mine when I graduated nursing school and that just started the um, process of me having my charm bracelet some of the ones I just look over the charms with you and show you because they're all very very special to me like I said you know my husband is a freelance photographer that's his hobby and so this little camera and the old school film case is um, one of the initial charms that I got as well. That was from him. And um, the next one is Washington, D.C. If you know me, you know that is where I was born and bred. And so that is just my little piece of home that I carry with me. My daughter thinks that she's a Texan. And she loves Texas history um, and is fascinated by the Alamo. And every time we go to San Antonio, we have to stop by the Alamo. And this is her little Alamo charm that she um, bought for me years ago. And of course, at some point, my baby played basketball. And we thought that she would have a great future in basketball until she said, Y'all only making me play basketball because I'm tall. And so we were like, probably, and she didn't want to do that anymore. Um, and Texas Tech is my alma mater, actually. I have their bow on today, too. Um, they are hosting round one of the NCAA female basketball um, finals this weekend. And I'm supposed to be at the game, but I was just so happy about this. I had to... Um, slow down on that. The game isn't until 5. I got a couple of hours. Parking is going to suck now, but I got my bracelet back. Um, of course, my life um, is a career soldier. And so my army charm that I hold near and dear to my heart. This one is very, very special. And um, I've had this one for years. And it says faith, hope, and love. And it is special to me because... One of my very, one of my initial patients when I began my labor and delivery nurse journey sent it to me after I assisted with the delivery of their first child. And I won't give their name because that's personal and it's private, but we remain in contact and I'm watching that little boy grow up and it is awesome. Um, so that one is very, very special to me. And it's set the scope because, you know, what I do um, for Mother's Day a couple years ago Samaya gave me one that said mommy and that was special to me because I um, prior to her giving it to me we had had a conversation about how I always want to be her mommy I, I never want to be mom or mom I always want her she started calling me mommy and it's been so special um, so anyway that's that one and this is a bottle of wine because we all have those days. Stop playing. When she quit bas when Samaya quit basketball, she started swimming. 
and she did really well at it. Um, and this is a little swimmer lady. Um, and I keep that. And we know I live in a house divided. So I do have a Texas Longhorn um, from my husband. And then an S. That's another one from Samaya. Um, simply because it's our first initial that we share. So those are all the current charms that I have. And it was in this little satchel because I had some other charms to I need to add to it. This one is from the 2010 A1 convention that was in um, Las Vegas. And that's special to me because um, this was the year I was voted into the board for my section of the A1 chapter. And then this is 2011 A1 conference that was in Colorado. Um, they don't even make these anymore. But anyway, so I needed to get these two put on. And that's why I put it all in this little satchel. And in my little mind, I put it in my car so I could have it with me next time I was in the area of the store that needs to put them on. And then I forgot. Like I said, I need to slow down. I'm doing too much. So that is my good news um, for today. Thank you for listening. Um, and that's my poo poo. Stop making faces. That's not nice. And um, mm -hmm. wish the Lady Raiders good luck tonight. Guns out.